And let's just start. Let's just start it. Yes, Shamoy Crucio. Welcome to Man V Fat oh, Newport. Nice. Yes, nice. yes, I pressed start. Oh. I'm here with our resident BJ, Billy Jackson. Oh, we're back together. We haven't done this in ages. The referee is awaiting us to take our position as he always does. Oh no, he isn't. Oh no, it's started. <laughs> Do I know a fun fact, champ? My favourite player of all time is Rob Sidney. Is it Sydney or Siderham? I don't care. I just, just want him in any top ten anyway. One of one of today's life's questions. Fun times. The returning residents of, of Spencer Evans. Thank you for saying that. That's why that's why he's the best player of all time. Look at that. Good defending there from our little ginger teddy bear. Feels nice being stood next to a BG. Plays the ball behind Tom Sands. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! We've lost the camera. <laughs> We've lost the ref. <laughs> That's why Rob is the greatest player of all time. That's why we love Rob. Yep. We've lost the camera. Oh, the camera's gone. The, the clock's gone, isn't it? Everything's gone. No, we're back in. We're back Carnage. in. We're all right. We're all right. We're all right. Carnage I think that's the first time I have ever witnessed that happen. I'm not going to lie. It was your fault. More. Oh, nicked away by Dan. Not enough. Back to Paul in goal. James Morlin's emotionally upset tonight because Jurgen Klopp's leaving Liverpool. As if anyone actually yeah, cares. A lot of emotional upset because Jurgen Klopp's leaving Liverpool. Can't wait for Carragher to come in and Gary Neville go to Old Trafford. Good football. Not moving his feet for anyone as he scoops the ball up. Oh, Luke is started in the sticks. I don't know this guy's on the ball, but he thinks he's a good footballer. I've just never seen anything about it. Like. Still nil-nil. Chaotic for us two minutes, wouldn't you say? Yes, yeah, we've had it all. Spencer killing for it in the middle. Oh, oh, it away. Oh, it's just no shake there. Yeah, George, George. Is it more than brilliant run. Oh, he deserves it. He's hit the, he's, I mean, no, he's hit the target. But there we go. Brilliant football leading up to that shot. Oh, Tom's played himself into trouble here. Chip wasn't going to let George take the shot this time. <laughs> Our opening goal. The screen seems very dark. It's because it hit the floor, I think. We could probably sort that out, but it's not. No, it's okay. We don't need to do that. Shoot! Yeah. Tom fails to take my advice and has played a ball instead to Jimmy. Back to Tom. Tom plays forward. Back for such some Danny box. He won't want to write home about that one. He wrote home about that though. Takes oh, the ball out of the leg. Spencer's got the ball. He's been after Meg. He is bad. Everyone's favourite player. Hi, bad. Do you know what wrongs with bad? Yes, 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 Rob again, and they cut through to George. He'll have another bite of the cherry here. Go. Three minutes, two nil. Your prediction was so, wasn't it? Yeah, I think it was. I always thought it was going to be a bit one way, unfortunately, but. I do like the character in, in the Slimson's team. Stranger things have happened. Oh. Yeah. They just, they just, they just, boy, the, you know, they just missed uh, a couple of footballing heads. But it's a weight loss programme. And if they're all doing very well on the scales, then, then you can't ask for any more. Speaking of very well on the scales, 15% for Luke tonight. Oh, well, turn, so. Mr. Mr. Topknot, yeah? Giving his team a 3 0 head start with that plaudit. And a shot and a save! Brilliant shot from Rob. I'm still waiting for him versus Doody in an arm wrestle match and the loser loses their top knot. Oh, speak like that. Horror talk. <laughs> Luke's is so much more than a top knot at this stage, he's a personality. Oh, great feet from Chip. And a great save. Rob brings that down with I'm not going to take any credit away from the goalkeeper there, but it was such a very, it was such a bad shot. It was rubbish. It was a rubbish. It was a terrible shot. Is John new? Is John newbie? John? Yes. Yeah. For Spencer Evans. Wilmot Smith. 
Chance to half the deficit there. Away goals do count. That was a way to get to notch one on the board. Always nice to see you. Oh, we got some light on the screen now. I can see. Adaptive lighting, I think they call it. Go, go, gadget lights. Adam crosses to John. Morling gives him an option after moving his head out of the way. No idea what's going on there. Oh, there we do. Dan's hit the one. ball. He's bringing it into the middle. He's lost the ball up. Referee has had no advantage. We're coming back over for the free kick. I'm just going to pass this to you if I can for 30 seconds, just so I can have a sip of my beverage, which uh, I'll take this opportunity to drink. Drink Tango Orange, not water. I actually thought I picked up a Pepsi Max. I picked up the wrong can. <laughs> you sponsored by Tango Orange? Do you want to know to say about them? Uh, enjoy the thirst because Spencer's back. That's the slogan for Tango. I mean, OK. <laughs> As a fellow member of the Ginger Brotherhood, what are your thoughts on Spencer's return? If he sticks at it and, and, and works hard through the weeks and, you know, he's re reaping his rewards on the scales, just like, what is, you know, the reasons that we're here, then, then he's going to be really successful. But that comes down to his uh, sort of mental strength in wanting, in wanting it. If he wants it, then you've got to put the effort in. Um, so we'll, we'll see. Chip on the ball in the far left. Lasted longer than Rob Taylor. Oh, I mean, it always makes me sad when that comes up. Oh, Rob would have wanted to have been more alert there. He wasn't. Reese across the goal to Dan. He was a boy, you need No, I get it. We've already had this once. Thank you. Spencer does it all the way back to Luke. Resume. You're on next, did you say? Yeah. Are you ready to go? Yeah, got my top in me, in me pocket. Say we're ready to go or not. Is it Tom? <laughs> I don't know how good the commentary is. I don't know how good the voice is. Leave, leave a comment if you hear about the chapo's there. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, play resumes. I'm just looking for Shot. another one. Jimmy is taken to the goal. We've not allowed him to get his gloves on. He's just going to... Bish is going to let him put his gloves on. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Bish. He looks like he's got huge hands with tiny gloves. Gets the ball out. Like James gets in the way. He's going to turn and go back. Oh, brilliant feet. John hooked that over the top. Hubbard is here, but he's not come on yet, by the looks of things. Maybe they're bringing him on at half time. Is he here? He is here. Brilliant feet again by George. Obviously, you wouldn't have seen that. Chavo was looking for Hubbard. Morlin finds Rob. No, he doesn't. Be interesting to see the reception the gets. He plays it on the line. It's a Morlin in the middle. There's a shot. Yep. BJ's ball's just dropped. Yep. Robert Smith with a great through ball to Luke. Just all the way into chip. That, that, that oh, guy, like yeah. That, that guy over there, I don't know who he is, but yeah, yeah he's on the ball again. George! Flying down the way. Ignored by George. Just not finding him. He's, 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 he's never really there, is he? So, sad to see him. I've saved this for the middle. Of the of the match, bit of a chance lull. for oh, Wes. I called it a lot. Oh, it's not even Wes. It won't even Wes. I don't even know if I got it. Oh, we are doing the sub now. Hubbard's going to come on. Hubbard and Richie's now here. Hubbard and Richie replacing Chip and George. It was him. Paul's going to come out a goal. Not sure what happened there with the. Seven minute changeover, they're doing it on because like they're doing nines, they're not doing sevens, they're doing nines. That nines with two subs, yep, that's that what we is quite clear. Well, I say that's what we do at Centreford, but I, that's what I did at, at Fat Chester when we had two, uh, two subs, you do nine, everyone comes off once, nine minutes each. Richie straight into the game, straight with the drive, good save. 
Oh, he slipped. He's gone down. There was a bit of a noise. Here's an interesting stat for you. Because uh, Sean Thomas at Centreford keeps all stats. Richie Nesbitt, whilst at Centreford, okay, had a grand total of 139 shots. He hit the target twice. That's an impressive amount of shots. <laughs> it's an impressive length on target for him. <laughs> and the line went straight through him. John wicks it away. Wes will have a go now. He runs. He's just all on the shirts around him. He's done well to keep it. Spencer Evans. Spence can he get? He's got time now on the ball and space. Oh. Nicked away by Hubbard. He's galloping down the wing. <laughs> Lots of options forward, not to be. The score remains 2 0. I'm watching the game and I'm completely losing focus on the camera. It's been such a while since I've done commentary. Good to have you with us, even if it's just for the day. Luke, looking for options. And he finds Dan. Probably not what he wanted there from that. But he's battled hard to keep hold of it. And here's Wes. Wes does have a tendency to stick a couple oh. in the top corner. Adam will run down, down the middle. Oh, it's still a bit hard. You want to see a little bit more time taken by the Neverthings in each interaction. Just a little bit more time to think about what they're going to do and then do it properly. by Jimmy. I wouldn't be convinced that was in the box. I feel like the Simpsons are just like to slow the game down a little bit when they got the ball with the goalkeeper. Just to look at some options because there is goals in this team. They are on a couple of chances. It's a fun game for you, Champo. Right. Great strike, good save. If okay. all of a sudden the fence around the pitch disappeared. Not the wooden boards, but the fence around the pitch and the net disappeared. And it became a 15-man Royal Rumble. Who would win? Well, it depends who the other 14 characters are in there, because I'm definitely one of them. Everyone on that, well, we're outside. So it's the two teams on the pitch now and Bish. Who you, who you got? I and Bish going out first. Someone's turning on him. Do you know what? Luke Rogers will be a, a dark horse. Yeah, yeah, knows his stuff. You'd be a dark horse. If I was in there, Hubbard, be... Hubbard, Hubbard looks like he's the sort of guy that might just... Um... Final four, Hubbard for me. Final four. Hubbard just looks like the, the sort of guy that just wants to get out of there, so he'll jump out straight away. Oh, I don't know. He's got a competitive edge to him. No, he'd leave. He'd leave and Morling would follow him. I'd, I'd bat Rob to win. Uh, Paul, Paul, Paul James would have a shake, I reckon. He'd be a dark horse, yeah, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, feisty. Oh, lovely ball by Rob. <laughs> Tom Sines whips that up. Dan. Dan's going to get his foot on the end of that. Oh! Oh, oh it's a big call to make there. It was a complete accident, though, I think. <laughs> it was. Adam's foot was, Adam was straight up. He knew he did it. Dan. We're bringing Chip back on. I don't know who we're bringing Chip back on for. John's coming That was off. a clever foul as the trigger was a big pulled. It was. Coming off for a but it was a complete accident, I though. I agree it was. I'm not saying on camera. It was a clever foul if he meant it. Yeah, you don't have to. You don't have to say it on camera because the voice picks up everything. <laughs> so the new guy's first game and he's asked to come off. He's done 13 minutes to be fair to him. Yeah, yeah, it's a you know, fair it's play to him. All in one go. Oh, he's missed the ball, Spencer, and absolutely well. <laughs> it's in Shot it. and goal. How? How crucial of a, a, a tactical foul was that? Because they've gone from almost conceding at one end, which should have been a goal, and then Kent did the sack the free kick, and it's now 3-0. If there's anyone apart from Adam, I would give that... I would give that master tactician status. But it was an accident. Drags that wide, pull back... Oh, the yeah, league. sorry, the police ain't here. I'm still on the halfway line. <laughs> Adam beats the ball. Pull oh, another shot, drag wide. He's getting further and further. Uh, so I reckon the winner of the Royal Rumble is going to be, if I had to pick one from each team for the final two, I would leave Paul James and Luke Rogers. Oh, in that final two, Paul definitely eliminates Luke. Unless I hop over, because I like Luke, not that I don't like Paul, but Luke's a Man United fan. You help him win. Paul's not, so I might just try and chuck Paul out with him. Uh, interesting. Or me and you can just jump in, chuck them both out, and, you know, Fight we're death. like Billy and Chuck, aren't we? We are, We're yeah. Like Billy and Chuck. Who would be Billy and who would be Chuck? Well, you'd have to be Billy, wouldn't you, Billy? Yeah, but Billy's Billy's still going. I mean, Billy's far more active than Chuck is. I don't even know what Chuck's doing, though. 
stood next to you. I think Billy will die in a wrestling ring. That's why. <laughs> Billy, Billy is a freak of nature. That's what Billy is. If we had to have everybody, if we had to pick one person from each team then to go into a Royal Rumble end. Oh, what a 10-man battle royal. This is the question to you. So a 10-man battle royal. So we'll go with one from each team here. Who would you be picking? So I'm picking as like a strongest... Strongest from each team to represent team in the ten man battle. In a ten man over the broken fence battle royal. Yeah. Okay. Um, well, I, I I'm struggling to look any further than Rob from Everything's. He'd be my Rob Sider, huh? Yeah. He'd be my entrant from the Everything's. Uh, and for Slimpsons. <sighs> I've not seen Spencer fight, but I've seen Spencer try and get in many fights. He would be an interesting person to throw in the mix. Uh, just stop olive oil. Devin Smith. <laughs> Devin Smith, next question. Centreford. <laughs> you. Um, Miami. So, they've got lots of people I'd like to see. Maybe I'll have, for Miami, we'll have a qualifier match where they all fight each other when it goes through. <laughs> uh, your, your team, the Refrigerators? Uh, I mean, I would be, if, if, if this was a real thing, I'd be fighting to the death to ensure it was me. But I think we'd probably have better representation in someone like Dario. Yeah, okay. He doesn't like losing, just Dario. Okay. Um, Great feet by Rob. However, everyone... <laughs> Anyone that doesn't like wrestling watching this is going to be less than impressed. Yeah, no. Chip takes it in the middle. Back to Adam. Adam will have a go. Saved by Jimmy. Good save, keeper. Um, I'm trying to think of the teams off the top of my head. Tropicana. Ooh. I'm a big fan of Lee from Tropicana. I'd like to see Lee, Lee get his dues, get his opportunity. I don't think Eddie would, would, would want anyone but himself because he's a massive wrestling fan himself. That's true, that's true. Um, what are the teams we've got? Purples. Can't think what they're called. Oh, Bradders. Yeah, Bradders, straight in there. Purples with Bradders. Straight in there. And then we've got, we've got two teams to go. we got uh, Fat and Furious. Banny. Banny would be a favourite to win that, I think. And we're missing one team. Sorry if that's your team. No, because you said me for centre foot. Well, no, but the team was <laughs> listening. I'm like, gonna, I, you're going you're, you're to commentate. I'm going to think what it is. Okay. Yeah, but now I can't stop thinking about who it might be. Chip. He's brought it into the middle. Show, save! Great save by the keeper. Tom Simons. First down by Rob. Intercepted by Tip, he's kept it out of the keeper's box. He's going to have a go. Richie! Grab <laughs> a handball, not a given. Rob to the middle. Hubbard, Spencer. strike! Spencer politely told him what he thought of that. Another shot by Richie. I can see what... Oh, it's gone it's in. in! eventually. They made it. They made it happen. Fair play to Spencer. Didn't give up on any of that whatsoever. 4 2 nil. Uh, I'm just going to... I'm just going to look at my phone, I know it is. No, 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 we can do this, Champo, we can do this, we no, don't need I'm to cheat. No, we don't it. need to cheat. Right, I'm going to have to try and get there before you. Marseille. Marseille! And we we'll have to put Steve Knowles in. Oh, it's Marseille, yeah. Marseille. Of course it is, of course it is, just told you. Yeah, just told yeah you Marseille, yes, you're right, yeah. Steve Knowles. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> Craig, you have to get Craig in there. Craig, Olympic de Marseille, undefeated since Craig took the helm there. George Rispace, pass to Richie, who I'm sure will have another shot. Got him. Spencer again there. Are you still leaving five minutes before the end? Yes. I'm going to be back five minutes before the end. Okay, don't you, mate? Good day to you. Hey, one more move. Yeah, 
Strike by Morlin, it's in the corner. It's five. Adam Jones in goal for Nether Things at this point. Here's Luke. Simpsons will still go. Well, we'll still keep going. Well, not Smith. It was a good ball from Spencer. It's unlucky. Here's Hubbard. White to chip. Back to Hubbard, keeping the ball nice and simple here. Here's Richie. Can't believe we got a th on camera shot that we got Richie passing the ball. <coughs> Last seven. No subs for the last seven. Sorry, I just bent down to pick up my can. Morlin finds Adam. Oh, poor, not Adam, it's poor. Good football. Well blocked. Gang of Simpsons, ah, oh, touch. He's won it back, he's kept the ball. He's battled really hard to keep that ball. Well done, Wes. Spencer, just up in the air. It's dropped behind him. Ball in forward to Richie. He's probably going to shoot. Yeah. Yeah, he did. It's a great ball from Tom Simon. Just over hits slightly towards Dan. Good ball inside, Richie. That was a heavy touch. George with the strike. Back to the goalkeeper. I'm going to leave you in the wonderful hands of Billy Jackson now. As he's returning, as I'm going to go and get ready. Salutations. Nothing else has changed, it's still five. Five? It's four now, this. Uh, well, it's five now. <laughs> 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 and Chip with the strike it's hit the post I'm not sure if the keeper got anything on it it's gone back to him but I have said farewell I'm going to leave you with, with Mr Billy good day Jackson to you Jumbo good this. luck all the best stay in touch get your knees up more in Home to Adam Jones. George finds Richie. Richie finds Chip in the middle. Great play. Oh my goodness. Excellent football by the Neverthins. Paul is not going to... Not going to write home about that one. Luke, Tom. Intercepted by Chip. Spencer says... Cheerio. Oh, searching for Wes, just trying to find, just trying to break through. George, big searching ball across the face of goal, finds Paul, oh, another touch, probably not what he wanted. Goes, trickles all the way back to Morlin. Rich in the middle, plays through, get another one of these shots. George, over, that's going to come out of the box.
All the way back home to Hubbard. Hubbard looks pushed forward now in the middle. Disrupted by the Simpsons and they're away again. Oh, Wes not got everything he wanted on that. Great feet by Chip. Gets the ball away. We're going down the middle. Richie. Back to Chip. Sends him on his way. Um, saved by Jimmy. <laughs> Good feet by Luke. Nicked away by Paul. Luke's chasing the ball. Gets it away. 50% by Luke can make all the difference tonight. I'm not sure anyone's done anything there. Reese will press forward. Not enough power on that one. And everything's win the ball back. We're pushing back forwards. Last two minutes. George, give us a wave. That counts. Chip, strike! Ah! Oh. Keeper was already down. <laughs> not, not sure why that might have been. It is the sixth though. It is they're within six. Slimpson's nil. Give us a wave, Spence. Is that counts? Spence a challenge for the ball. Home to Luke. And everything's just making real nuisance of themselves. All the way home to Jimmy the keeper. Have it! Make sure next time, Luke. Well done. Well done, my boy. That's gone over and never to be seen again. 90 seconds to go. Waiting for that ball back. Where's where's the other ball gone? Why are there not two balls here? George, you got any jokes while we wait? Any what? Snowball. Snowmen play football. Go on. It's snowball. <laughs> That's a good one. I hope you score after that. Morlin's running in the middle. Paul. To the funniest man on the Neverthins. Probably. Probably not the one. Not the one. Down with a chance now. Great challenge by Morlin. About 30 seconds to go. Still time for the Simpsons to call one back. Could make all the difference. As I said, this game will not be decided out here. I'm fairly confident of that. Shit! Chip with a brilliant ball finds the funniest man and everything. He comes off the boards. That's going to find Tom Simes all the way back to the keeper. And that is time. Time at the bar. Slimpson's nil, Neverthin's six. A good game, certainly a well spirited game. Thank you all very much for watching. Bye.